Yo, you too, man. What's up with y'all, boy? Man, day 106 right here. Uh, we got legs and shoulders. Starting out with the leg press. We got eight plates right here. A um, little warm up, you know. Eight plates, I don't know how much that is. 845. That's a good uh, good weight to start on. We're going to hit 15 reps. Yeah, man, let's get to it, man. Good little day today, man. Good little day today. It's like 12, 23, so about 12.30 in the morning. Uh, so, yeah, man, let's put work in, man. All right, baby, we're going to hit one more set of this hoe before we move on, so let's get to it. Alright, baby, we're moving on to the first set of military press, man. Let's get to it, man. Alright, baby, we moved up to nine plates on each side, nine forty-fives. Let's get to it. All right, baby, now we moved up to 275 right here. Let's get to it, man. I just had this thought, bro. The, the people that you had or called friends when you was a little kid or when you was younger or coming up, you don't realize that, you know, people can change until you see for, from your very eyes, bro. Like, I had a homeboy, bro, that I was cool with, like, real cool with. We live right around the corner from each other, bro. I go to his crib. I knew his people. His people love seeing me. Uh, he, come, he came to my crib. My people love seeing him, sorta, kinda sorta. Me and him were fun, but we was like, we was like this, bro. And unfortunately, our parents lived, started living different places. And uh, unfortunately, we couldn't bond, keep that bond going. But man, I heard not, not too long from when we had moved away from him, that he was in jail, locked up for three years for Robert. And when I, when, I, when I think about it, bro, bro was like that when we was kids. Like, we would go to the store every time, bro. I would get, I'll get me, you know, bag of chips, something to drink, you feel me? He'll get him something. And every time we came out the store, he would have a pocket full of gum. And I'm like, bro, how you getting all that gum, bro? I know I didn't buy that. Well, you didn't buy that either. So how the hell are you getting all that? He said he would he would act like he tied, bent over, take everything. He was like, bro, you should do it. I was like, hell no, bro, that shit, you know what I'm saying? Well, I wasn't like that. I was, I was a kid, you know what I'm saying? But I still like knew that shit wasn't right. You know what I'm saying? But still though, it was it was it was we were still cool. We was cool. We were like damn their brother. And uh it's it was crazy to hear that bro was in jail. That's another thing on how the world can show you that it's real. Like we in real life, you know. Uh, ain't no kicks and giggles, bro. You only got one life, one body, one soul. It's you, you know. And it's it's kind of it made me like realize, bro. And I heard. I haven't spoken to him since before we moved. I spoke to somebody that we was cool with, that both of us was cool with. And bro said that he he be on some weird shit, like he he be trying to pimp people and all type of weirdo shit. And it's like, bro, I never thought he would be the one to be the person to act like that, to do those type of things, you know? And unfortunately he was, you know, and it it made me sad, but hey, that's life, bro. I hate the fact that people got to exit my life, but I mean, it's necessary, bro. Uh, it, it made me feel like I shouldn't even bond with anybody in, to begin with, you know? It made me feel like that, but 
If you if am I the only one that feel that way? Like, why? What's the point? What's the point of dating that girl when she gon' one day not even like me no more? Say that she love me, say she love me, she love me, but one day she decide, oh, I don't fuck with this dude and dip, break my heart. I'm the type of person that will stay. Once I say I love you, bro. I for real mean that I love you, dog. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's forever. Love cannot fade. You know, it makes me realize that people not like me. You know, uh, most people not, they don't, they, they love is lust or it's liking what that person does to them or for them. You know what I'm saying? It's not love, you know? Uh, love is unconditional. It has no strings attached to it. I was dating this one girl, bro. Um, I only dated, two, like, like me, I only dated two women. Um, I had the previous girlfriend, I realized how, what love was, and I realized that I was deeply in love with her, you know? And she messed me up bad, you hear me? She did me dirty twice. Well, she broke up with me twice, did me dirty. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. Um, but she made me realize, bro, um, that people come into your life to teach you a lesson, you feel me? Uh, I, now I, I now know that I can't trust people. I can't trust people because although I will, I'm a trustworthy person, not, not too many people are trustworthy. Not too many people will like me. Um, I have morals and I stand on those morals. Not too many people do that. I got to take everybody with a grain of salt, for real. Pause, no, no ditty. I don't know what the hell to say with that. I'm not trying to eat people. I'm not Jeffrey Dahmer. But anyway. It just made me realize, bro, like, it's a lot of people in this world, bro. And uh, you just got to roll with the punches, to be honest with you. I don't want to say that. I don't like saying that because I like having everything planned out. You, I mean, you're supposed to have everything planned out, but you're not really not. You know, you're just supposed to just have your faith in God, bro. Put put work in and shoot. Everything come, everything come to fruition. That's what I believe, so. But anyway, man, I just had to ramble on about that. You know, I had that on my mind. I started thinking about my my homeboy that's, that went down the wrong path. I had a lot of, I got a lot of homeboys that went down the wrong path. Unfortunately, some of them are dead. And you just got to pray, repent for your sins, you know. And yeah, walk with God, bro, the best you can. You know, you're going to stumble. You're going to stumble on that path, bro. This world rejects everything godly. This world rejects everything godly, and it takes in everything demonic. I'm telling you. Keep your eyes out. Study, man. Not everybody perfect, like I said uh, before, but just try to be your best self. You know, that's what I. That's that's my advice. But let's do this 275 real quick. <clears throat> All right, bet. Now we moved up to 10 place on east side, 1045s. We're gonna do this two sets. Uh, last for the last two sets of leg press. And yeah, man, let's get to it, man. Been last set of the leg press, man. Let's get to it. <laughs> I right, been last set of the military press. We got 315, man. Let's get to it. <laughs> 